Hi, my name is Dr. Scruggs, and in this video we're going to cover eyelid cancers. Eyelid cancers are a common problem that we frequently see. Your most common types of cancer are basal cell and squamous cell, and less commonly melanoma. Usually, cancers are removed using either a frozen section technique or a Mohs technique. The surgery typically takes about 30 to 60 minutes depending upon the complexity of what we're doing. The method that is used to remove the cancer depends on a lot of different variables that we will discuss at your visit today. Most technique essentially involves removal of the lesion by a dermatologist. The dermatologist will remove the lesion and then check the margins to make sure it's removed and then send you to see me usually within one to two days for the reconstruction. Depending upon the scenario, we may also remove the lesion under frozen section control. That involves me removing the lesion and usually at the same time doing the reconstruction. When we remove the lesion, we'll send it off to the pathologist. In about 30-40 minutes, they let us know if we got it all, then we go ahead and put you back together. The reconstruction technique that we use varies greatly depending upon the size of the cancer and the size of the defect after its removal. After the surgery, you'll go home and we'll ask that you ice the incision for the first one to two days, take it easy for about three days, including no heavy lifting or bending. Often we'll send you home with a patch, depending upon the location and the size of the lesion. We'll usually then see you back at about a week after the surgery, remove any patches or sutures that need to be removed, and then usually see you again at about a month. After that, very commonly we'll follow you for about three to six months just to ensure that the lesion does not reoccur. Thank you for choosing Central Florida Eye Specialist and we look forward to talking with you further.